Hello guys, welcome back to Elan App. For today's video, we are going to show you or discuss with you HP Omen 27 QS best settings. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. In this case, there are a few things I might want, you might want to change here to get out of the best out of your uh, HP Omen. So first is you might want to change the adapted sync. So first, make sure to turn on adaptive sync. This helps eliminate screen tearing and stuttering, giving you a smoother gameplay experience. Now for response time, set this to, in this case, to fast. This reduces motion blur so you can use or see quick movements more clearly, super important in competitive gaming. Next is want to update your frame rate. Keep the frame rate upon any option enable. This option or ensures that your monitor matches the frames being produced by your graphics card, making everything look fluid. Now for crosshair, it is recommended turning the crosshair off. It keeps your screen cleaner and allows you to focus on the game without distractions. Now, what about message timers? So make sure the message timer is also turned off. Now, it actually prevents unnecessary notification from clustering your screen during gameplay. For brightness, set this to around 80. So this level gives you a good balance between, in this case, letting you see details in darker scenes without waste washing out color. Now for contrast, set this to around 85. This will enhance the difference between light and dark areas, making images pop and improving overall visibility. Now, what about dynamic contrast? Now, it's best to turn dynamic contrast off. This ensures consistency or consistent image quality rather than having fluctuating brightness levels during game. Now for black stretch, make sure the black stretch is actually turned off. This helps maintain true black levels in your images, giving you a more accurate representation. Now for sharpness, set this to level 4. This will provide clear, defined edges and making details more dis discernible without introducing any artifacts. Now for color settings, you want to choose, or in this case, choose the native for your color settings. This ensures you're getting the most accurate colors for your immersive experience. Now what about gamma? So set the gamma to 1. This helps keep brightness and contrast balance all across scenes. Now for digital volume, adjust the vol digital volume to 55. This can enhance over image clarity without overexposing bright areas. Now for G-Sync, enable G-Sync and G-Sync compatible. This will synchronize your monitor's refresh rate with your graphics card, reducing lag and making your gameplay even smoother. And that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to Elan App. Thank you for watching.